Hey there, Monster High. Queen Cleo is back. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Queen my foot. What did you just say about my friend? <laughs> you want me to repeat it? Forget it, Luna. She's not worth it. Hey, look! Deuce and Heath are already here! Why isn't Deuce paying you any attention? Seriously, why are you guys getting on my nerves this early? Move along! <sighs> Don't make me say it twice. <sighs> Laguna, come with me. Whoa! Our mean girls Cleo and Laguna here, and Cleo seems to be heading your way. Heath, cut it out. You know we broke up last summer. Tell her that. <sighs> Hi! Hey, boys! Greetings, beauties. <laughs> Heath, you'll burn my clothes again. Get lost. Shh, sure thing. So, Deuce, how you been? Missed me? No. Oh, uh, I see. You don't want to talk in front of the others, Laguna. Got it. I'm leaving. Cleo, this doesn't change anything. I didn't miss you. Oh, come on. I guess you were fine during the summer, but how will you survive without me in school? How will you survive without our playdates? Making fun of newcomers isn't a playdate. I've changed, Cleo, and I'm not interested in you or your playdate anymore. <laughs> Did he just reject you? I'll remind him of this. He won't find anyone better than me. And you deserve better than some Gorgon. Uh, how about a fiery... Majo? <sighs> Leave me alone. My daughter, happy 15th birthday, yay! Thanks, but I have some news. Uh, later. First, blow out the candles and make a wish. Come on. <laughs> what did you wish for? To be well accepted to Monster High. Uh, oh. Dad, aren't you happy? Uh, well, you see, um, you're only half monster. The other half is human. If they find out at school... Nobody will find out, Daddy! Please let me go there! People are afraid of me! And this is the only place where I can be myself! Uh, all right! Yay! You're the best! <laughs> I've already packed my things! Wow! This is the portal to school! Bye, Dad! Goodbye! Remember, you can't reveal your human side! Monster High! I still can't believe it! Everything here is so cool! Oh, hello! I mean, I'm sorry. Hello, too! I'm Claudine, the new girl! Ah, Claudine! Very nice to meet you! <sighs> Quiet! I miss Bloodwood, the headmistress! Very pleased to meet you! I'm so glad you accepted me into the school! Well, how could we not? You're the daughter of the best student we've ever had! Now, find your room and get to class quickly! You don't want to be late on your first day, do you? Of course not! That's the spirit! She's so nice! Wait, where's my room? Oh no, how am I going to find my room now? I told her if she approaches me one more time, I'll spit fur at her. And what did she do? She ran away. She's allergic to fur, you know. <laughs> <laughs> hey, girls. Yeah. yeah. I'm Claudine, the new girl. And I can't seem to find my room. How's that our problem? Well, maybe you can help me find it? No. Nope. Your room will find you. Hmm. All right. It will find me. How interesting. Oh! Wow! It looks like they were right! Wow! This bed is so cool! Oh! Wait! It's my bed! That's awesome! <laughs> 
Hey there! Are you my new neighbor? Yep! I'm Claudine! Nice to meet you, Claudine. I'm Frankie. And well, let's just say I'm made up of body parts from the smartest and coolest people. Cool! I'm a werewolf! A werewolf? <gasps> so like, wolves and stuff, right? That's rad. What are you up to? <gasps> homework, maybe? They never mentioned homework to me! Oh no! I'll be unprepared for class! Relax, I'm just trying to figure out this whole life thing, you know? I've only been here for 15 days. Wow, that's interesting. I won't bother you then. By the way, what's up with that coffin over there? Best not to mess with it. Why not? Is there someone inside? It's me. That's Draculaura! She's also living in our room. I'm not living in your room, you're living in mine, got it? <laughs> okay, no need to get mad. I won't go near your coffin anymore. Phew, how do you spend so much time in here? It's such a tiny space. Do you have a secret passage or something? <sighs> Just get out. Remember that this part of the room is mine and don't step into it. All, All right. right. <sighs> you're annoying. Isn't it time for us to head to class? Yep, it's time. Let's go. What about her? Let's not bother her. She'll come on her own. How so? Laguna, explain. How could he reject someone like me? <laughs> Seems like our deuce can't think straight. It's <gasps> annoying. Hey, hey there. there. Oh, Meow Liddy and Persephone, finally. You got any news? Yep. yep. We got a new girl. A werewolf. Ew, that's so cringe. Another one with fur? Hey, we have fur too, you know. Exactly. We've got enough of you. <laughs> All right. We need to meet with this new girl so she knows who's in charge here. <laughs> oh, I'm so nervous. Why? It's just a lesson. That's the thing. My first lesson at Monster High. I hope everything goes well. Well, of course. I can't go any other way. Um, hi. Oh, hello there, new girl. I'm new too. I'm Frankie. Nice to meet you. Uh-huh. Very nice. And who are you? I'm Claudine. I'm Laguna. And this is Chloe. We're the most popular girls in school. Don't even think about messing with us. I wasn't planning on it. I'm actually very friendly. We can even be friends. Ew. Ew uh, no no way. way. Suit yourselves. Let's go, Claudine. Did we give you permission to leave? Do I need permission? Of course. You're a werewolf, right? I wonder what tricks you can do. <laughs> Probably fetch a ball like a dog. <laughs> 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 well, actually, I can growl. <laughs> Maybe we should leave. Yeah. Wow. You're so good at that. I didn't expect that myself. <laughs> well, this is something. I've never seen Cleo scared of anyone before. You're great. Thank you. Hey, you're Claudine, right? I'm Deuce Gorgon. Very nice to meet you. Lesson time. We need to go. Hey, I'm heading to the same class. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Nothing much. Upset that Deuce is eyeing the new girl, huh? Come on, Laguna. He's not into her at all. Hey, kids. I'm your new teacher, Mr. Colmos. Hi, Hi Mr. Mr. Colmos. Colmos. Let's kick off our first class. Who can tell me who the monster's arch enemies are? Yes, Cleo? Humans. Humans are the monster's biggest enemies. <gasps> That's right. And who can explain why? Yes, Frankie? Humans chase and wipe out monsters throughout their lives. Exactly. But maybe not all humans are bad. Maybe they hunt us because they're scared. Actually, yeah. Maybe humans just don't know us well. Heath, <laughs> that's nonsense. Humans have always been the ultimate evil. I heard there was a human who once went to our school. <gasps> Did you really 
are saying about that. can't be true. Yeah, there's... Yeah, but he was not entirely human. His name was Hyde, and he was half monster, half human. Wow, just like me. What? You were saying something? Nah, never mind. So what happened to this Hyde? Did he just graduate? Nope. As soon as they found out he was half human, they kicked him out of the school. <sighs> I'll serve him right. All right. Back to our lesson. Mr. Comos, I wanted to ask you about this Hyde. Sure thing, Claudine. What's up? Couldn't he have gone full monster and ditched his human side? Well, rumor has it he set up a lab on school grounds and brewed a potion that could turn someone into a full monster. Whoa! Where's this lab? Where is the lab? Uh, I, I doubt it exists. It's all just rumors. Have a great day, Claudine. Miss Bloodgood, you wanted to see me? Oh, Claudine, come on in. Take a seat. So, how's everything going? First day at school treating you all right? Yeah, things seem to be good. I'm enjoying it here. I've always wanted to go to Monster High. You take after your mom. Shame she's not around anymore. Yeah, she was awesome. I miss her. And what about your dad? You do have a dad, right? Um... Yeah. Well, who is he? A werewolf? Vampire? Gorgon? What's his name? Harry. Harry? That doesn't sound like a monster name. Uh, he's from England. Got it. So, what is he? Also a werewolf? Yep, he is. I, I feel, feel like, like I'm, I'm turning, turning into a human, human right, right now. now. What's the matter? You feeling okay? Yeah, I'm alright. Just really gotta... Use the bathroom! She's quite something! Darn it, darn it, darn it! I hope no one sees me and figures out I'm a human! Amortis Lamare! What are you doing? What the heck are you barging in for? Are you casting a spell? No, get out! It's occupied here! Oh, jeez. Calm down, Claudine. Breathe. Breathe. <sighs> what are what you, are you doing? doing? Ah! Phew, it's you. So what are you doing here? Nothing. Yeah, right. Looks like you're up to something. No, I was just in the bathroom. Yeah, yeah right. right. We heard that someone is practicing magic at school. And that's strictly forbidden. Forbidden? Yeah. Yep. Do you think I'm doing magic? No way! I don't even know how to do it! Uh-huh, sure. We'll be keeping an eye on you. Oh, do whatever you want. We need to tell Cleo about this. Agreed. Darn! The books they give us have no information about this hide. I need to go to the library. Hey there. Hey, Deuce. Reading? If you want, I can help you with your homework. Nah. I'm managing fine. Uh, well, you're new at school, and I pretty much know everything here. Thanks. I'd love to, but I really need to go to the library. Well, then let's go together. I can help you pick out some books. I really appreciate that you want to help, but I'd rather go alone. Uh, all right. Maybe we can hang out some other time. Sure. That's a great idea. Uh, okay. See you later. See you! Cleo, 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 Cleo! Why are you shouting? All right, we saw Claudine. She's the new girl. And so, did she fall face first in a puddle or something? No! no. Then why the heck should I care about her? I only want stories of embarrassment. But it's worse than that. We think... She's, she's practicing, practicing magic. magic. What? Are you sure? Well... Did you see it? No. Well, we think so. You think? Right, now go and search her room. Got it. We'll do it. <sighs> it's kind of creepy here, isn't it? Oh well, who cares? We gotta find info on this hide guy. Hmm. Not this. 
Not that. Oh, this looks interesting. <gasps> Who's there? I'm ready to fight. Ah! Oh no, not this. No, no, please. I gotta hide. So it turns out you're a human? Not entirely. My mom's a werewolf and my dad's human. Wow. Well, I'm also made from humans, but I'm a monster. You won't spill the beans about me, right? Of course not. We're buddies. Thanks. You have no idea what this means to me. No biggie. Can you control when you turn into a human? Nope. It happens when I'm scared or nervous but I'll find the lab and this will all be over. Is that the lab hide bill as per the legend? I overheard your chat with Mr. Comos. I need an elixir from that lab. I want to be a full-fledged monster, not just half. Hmm. The school's basement has lots of locked rooms. Maybe one of them is the lab you're looking for. We gotta check it out. Are you in? Absolutely. Ready to roll? Yeah, but let's wait until I turn back into a monster. <laughs> Whoa, what are you furballs doing here? We're actually called Maolodia and Persephona. I don't really care. Get out of my room. <sighs> we were about to leave on our own. <sighs> <sighs> what are they nosing around for? So what's the deal? That vampire Draculaura kicked us out. She almost bit us. Found anything? No. <sighs> Always have to do everything myself. But there's a vampire in there! Well, I'm Cleo, and nobody better mess with me. Did you come here for something else? This is my room. I want to know about your werewolf roomie. I don't have friends. She's just my roomie. <gasps> then you won't mind if we go through her stuff. And what do you want from her? None of your business. Oh, not my business. <laughs> oh, girls, it looks like you've got some new friends. What? <laughs> Who are you talking about? <laughs> about these little guys. <laughs> Sit! <laughs> I feel uneasy here. Relax, it's just school. I think there's someone over there. Locomotus Targavari. Vod Retro Cleopatra. Whoa. She's doing magic. What are you doing here? What are you doing? Magic is a no-no at school. I know. But why are you practicing it? Because I want to. Uh-oh. If the headmistress finds out. She won't. Please don't tell her. She'll tell my dad and he definitely won't forgive me. Why? I actually think there's nothing wrong with practicing magic. We're monsters. Magical beings. Yeah, but magic is something humans do. And my dad hates them. Oh. He won't like Claudine then. Frankie, darn it! Oops, sorry. Uh, what's going on? Well, since I know your secret, I can tell you mine. <sighs> I'm half human. What? Wow, how did they even admit you to this school? They think my dad is also a monster, just like my mom. But we'll soon find Hyde's laboratory and Claudine will become a 100% monster. Yeah, easy for you to say. I doubt we'll find the laboratory. Well, if you promise not to report me to the headmistress, I'll help you. We promise! All right. Where is the search spell? Ah, oh, Osseo Hyde's laboratory. Uh, follow it! Look, we found it. What's this? Seems like a lock. 
Well, it looks like only the lab owner can open it. Hey, do you have any spell to open the door? Actually, I do. But it requires snake gorgon powder. Will a gorgon just hand over her snake like that? Definitely not. I think I know where to get a gorgon snake. Hi there. Deuce! Nice to see you. Didn't expect you to invite me for a date. A date? <laughs> no, you suggested going for a walk, so I thought it's not a date. <laughs> Just kidding, relax. You're joking. Whew. So, how's school surrounded by monsters? I heard you used to live near humans. Well, not exactly. We lived in a cabin in the woods, and humans rarely came by. Uh, well, lucky you. Yeah. Oops. I'm so clumsy. It's okay. I'll pick it up. Did you do something to my hat? There was just some lint on it, so I removed it. Um, thanks. Um, maybe you could tell me something about yourself. Me? All right. I'm 15. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm having a great time with you, but I have to go now. Promise to meet up with Hit. Wait! Can we hug goodbye? Of course, let's do it. Hey! Claudine, what are you doing? Nothing! Claudine! Okay! I need a Gorgon snake, and I was trying to sneak it from you. Mm, why didn't you just ask? Would you give it to me? Yes, if you tell me where you need it. It's a long story, and you really need to go now. No problem. I will text Heath that we will meet another time. So, I'm listening. <sighs> you might not like me after this, but okay. Can you imagine well, yes. this? <laughs> ow, ow, ow! Did you get the snake? <gasps> yep! Awesome, hand it over. Did Do see you? Nope, he gave it to me himself. <gasps> himself? <gasps> Just like that? Well, I told him who I really am, and he understood. He likes me! Are you out of your mind? What if he tells everyone? He won't! Do says the idea that humans and monsters are enemies is outdated. It's just that humans and monsters don't know much about each other. I think he's right. All right, let's turn the snake into powder quickly and okay. go! It won't work. We're being watched. <gasps> Get lost! <gasps> What do we do now? They'll follow us. And they'll tell Cleo everything. Um, then I'll go alone. You think they won't notice you? Nah. Just stay here. I'll be back soon. All right. This should work. Oops. What is she doing here? Aloha, Mora. Is she casting a spell? I need to tell Cleo right away! Oh, come on! Open up already! Hey! Hey! This is crazy! Come on! How much time has passed? It's been almost an hour. Jackie, Laura should have been back by now. Maybe we should go look for her? What about the twins? There's no one here. What if they grabbed her on the way and they're interrogating her or something? In that case, she definitely needs our help. Do you think we can make this happen? Draculaura! Are you okay? Mm -hmm. Did it work? Did you find the elixir? Yeah, the spell didn't work. The door didn't open. Well, it's okay if it didn't work this time. Maybe it will another time. What's going on here? Uh, Miss Blanket, hi. Well, why are you all silent? What have you been up to? Nothing. It was just her. Draculaura, you know that practicing magic is strictly forbidden. I know. Will you punish her then? She's the one who messed up. No. I'll have to report this to your dad. He'll figure out the punishment for you. Please. No. Not my dad. I'm sorry, but I have to do it. But my dad will ground me at home. Please don't tell him. <laughs> it's a spell! It's screaming! <laughs> did did you save me? Of course I did. 
What was that? Why is the school in chaos? I don't know. Let's search the rooms quickly and I'll try to figure out what's going on here. Maybe your dad will understand. <laughs> no, he's been in conflict with the witches his whole life. He won't forgive me. And the school is going crazy too. It's all because of me. I'm half human and the school is trying to kick me out. And it also framed you with magic. No, it's not your fault. It's Laguna and Cleo. But you helped me. Claudine, it's not your fault at all. We wanted to help you. Exactly. Let's get some rest. Goodbye. There you are. I've been searching for you everywhere. I've checked the whole area. Did you think we wouldn't find you? Why did you come here? <laughs> well, we're friends. And friends stick together. Oh, hey, don't be silly. Go back to school. Why? So the school can cause another commotion? Or everyone finds out I'm half human? Huh? Nobody's going to find out. We won't tell anyone. But what if someone accidentally sees me transform? All it takes is a little nervousness and I turn into a human. See? We'll find a way to get you the elixir. The headmistress has bigger problems now and she didn't say anything to my dad. So you are staying at the school? Yes, and I'll search for more spells to open the door. Nothing's going to help! I don't belong at Monster High! Ah! It's just like the imprint on the door to the laboratory! Ew! Claudine, you can open it! Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's do this. Mm -hmm. <sighs> She's opened up! Seriously, it's unlocked! Hooray! <laughs> Come on, let's go! Wow. wow! This place is amazing! Yeah, just like the lab where they created me! So many vials here! How are we gonna find the right elixir in this mess? I think it'll have a label on it. Girls! I think I found it! Well, what are you waiting for? Drink it! No, Claudine, don't do it! Mr. Coles? What are you doing here? I've been trailing you and it wasn't for nothing, Claudine. You don't need that elixir. Do you know she's half human? Yes, trust me. Your human side is not a weakness. Thanks to it, you can help end the feud between humans and monsters. Claudine? He's right! <gasps> what have you guys done? <laughs> Became a super monster! <laughs> the elixir gives you the power to get any ability you want! And now I'm gonna take all your powers! <laughs> but why do you need them? Revenge! Hyde is my dad, and I'm gonna get back at this school for kicking him out! <gasps> uh, 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 yes! Now I'm gonna annihilate all of you! <laughs> Run! Uh, uh, run! You won't be able to hide anyway! <laughs> How are you guys? I'm so weak. Can't move. What should we do? Komos is coming. We can't handle him alone. We need help. I'll text Cleo. She won't help. The school's in danger. She'll come. This is, this sad. is bad. So, what's the plan? You run for Heath and I'll go for Deuce. Got it. <laughs> oh! Can't hide from me, monsters! He's coming this way! Looks like it's just us against him! Not just us. <laughs> so, where's that monster you mentioned? Here I am! Lucky for you, you're all together! I'll take you down one by one! <laughs> just try! <sighs> oh, how scary! <laughs> 
It's your turn! You won't hurt her! Get ready to turn into stone! Oh, how scary! Uh, so ready to turn into stone? Ah! Too snow! Oh, you're human? Who's next? Who wants to lose their powers? <laughs> ah! Ah! Let's go! to fight him are you for real he's a powerful monster and i'm just a human exactly you're a human he can't take away your powers you have to save us <sighs> who is next maybe it's you frankie wait why did you turn away are you too scared to turn into stone like your buddy deuce no but you are no Did we get away? Yeah! <laughs> Claudine saved us! I told you she could do it! Hooray! Yeah! Well, Claudine, you saved Monster High! You won't kick me out for being half human, right? Only a human could stop Mr. Comos! That's why the school was screaming trying to tell you! So humans aren't monsters' enemies? Nope, it's time to update the old rules! Can we practice magic now? Absolutely! Especially since your dad gave his approval! Seriously? I told him everything that happened here, and he's even excited about your new interest! Wow! Congratulations! <laughs> Alright, now go take a break! No more classes today! <laughs> Jackie Laura, will you teach me magic? Of course! And me? Come on! <laughs> this is gonna be so cool! Oh, I might as well join in. Congratulations, you're a Monster High hero now. Well, that's a stretch. I'm no hero. You saved everyone. I think you deserve a tasty dinner on me. Well, that's a pleasant surprise. So, do you agree? Yeah. Why isn't she even looking your way? Seriously, why are you annoying me in the morning and so early? <laughs> Well, I didn't see that coming. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, first time I've ever seen her act like this. I totally forgot. Hey, Miss Bloodgood wanted you to come in. Oh, Claudia, you've already strutted in and taken your seat. Looking fantastic, <laughs> just like... <laughs> darn, darn, darn. I hope no one spots me and figures out I'm human. Half human, actually. <laughs> I need that powder made from Gorgon snakes. So, what about our Gorga Gorg... Gorgon. <laughs> Who's gonna be the next one petrified now? <laughs> <laughs> Only a human could assist Mr. Comos. Now I'm gonna wipe you all out! <laughs> no, that's totally normal. Kidding or something? I'm having a workout here. Hello? Do you even hear me? Is this a prank? What happened? Is this a Say goodbye to her. <laughs> Guys, is this a joke? What happened to me? <laughs> Why am I so ugly? Do I have the flu? I need to go to school. Maybe someone there can help me. Please help. Something happened to me. <laughs> Wait, I'm the cheerleading captain! Gosh, uh, 
What the heck? Uh, I'm popular. Everyone loves me. Why'd he run? What's wrong with this locker? Never seen anything like that. I gotta check it out. So we got those fangs. Can you imagine? Oh, 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 stinky zombie! Ew, disgusting! Don't touch me! Uh, where am I? Who, who are you? I'm a powerful vampire. And I'm a witch. You're in a monster school, actually. Was it really so hard to guess? Uh, she's a zombie. Her brain is rotten. Yeah, right. Her wheels ain't turning. Come to class! If you know where it is. <laughs> oh. Monster school? No wonder they're mean. Okay, I'm the most popular cheerleader. I can gain my popularity even here. Um, hey y'all, I'm a new student from another world. Yeah, yeah, fine. We all became monsters one day and ended up studying here. Sit down and don't interrupt me. Okay. Hi. Creepy zombie, don't sit next to me. But who's talking, furry monster? Uh, ah, you have rabies. Sit down. So, it's time to think about your extracurricular activities. Who has any ideas or suggestions? Uh, I have. I'll start a cheerleading team. I was the captain and the most popular girl in my first school. And what can you teach us? How to lose arms and heads during stunts? No one will ever join to the ugly zombies team. But I've always been beautiful and the most stylish. Now it's like my worst nightmare. I look like a corpse. Whatever. Guys, join my potions club. We will brew a love potion. I am arranging swimming training in the pool. And I... I still announce the opening of a cheerleading team. Come and you'll see that I am the best at this. <laughs> <laughs> I'll prove it. <laughs> well, I don't want to eat at all. Ugh. I have a strained muscle. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Look, the corpse is falling apart. Do you feel that stench? Ew! Ew. Shut up! I'm cool, popular, and I don't care what you say. I'm not afraid of you, bully! Oh. You will never be able to compete with me! You don't even have magical powers. You're just a walking dead. Let's go, girls. I don't want to be next to this dirty zombie. <laughs> That's so rude. Uh, I often bullied nerds and even my girlfriends, too. I didn't think I myself would ever be in their place. But I'll achieve my goals anyway. Someone should come to my tryouts for the start. Is really no one coming to practice? In my old school, dozens of students dreamed of becoming a cheerleader. Hey you, zombie girl! You've come! Yay! You're the coolest vampire, right? Wait! Um, let's try some moves. Here, start by holding the pom-poms. You can shake them with vampire super speed! <laughs> hey, don't touch me! I will never do this silly girl stuff! What? Then why did you come? To mock me? <laughs> <sighs> I... You know I got a deal for you. Interested? Well, you are the only one in this school who talks to me. So what do you want? You came here from the real world, right? Mm -hmm. Tell me how to get there. When I turned into a vampire, I was like in a fog. I don't remember anything. Yeah. I came from the real world. I had an awesome cheerleading team there. Oh, exactly! I can call my girlies here, perform our routine, and prove to you dumb monsters that we are the best! <laughs> Great plan! So, how to get there? This fool will lead me straight there. <laughs> uh, let's go and find your friends. Let's go. Do you really want to help me? Sure! Why not to help such a, um... Charming zombie. <laughs> uh, welcome to the real world. <gasps> hmm, 
Smells tasty. Mmm, fresh people. <laughs> Let's quickly find the girls. They're probably in the gym. I'll wait here for the right moment and then. Wait. Is Eva wearing a cheerleader captain's uniform? I'm the captain! Alice, practice new moves. Everything has to be perfect. My routines will be much better than that silly stuff that Tina came up with. <sighs> Honey, is your training over? I want to go to the cafe. <laughs> Let's go, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> what? That rat is kissing my boyfriend. <sighs> Stop. We look weird. They'll see us and call the cops. Or exorcists. But, but, but Eva is a traitor. She stole my boyfriend! Hey, uh, you left this world anyways, huh? And she stole my captain's place! I hate her! Uh, hush. I know he can take revenge on her, but we need a plan. Come on, you're gonna like it. <sighs> Nobody will find us here. Calm down. Let's lure the girls to monster school just like you wanted. No! I don't want to have anything to do with Eva! But you want to avenge her, don't you? Yes! There's simply the food for the monsters. Take them to school, perform your routines, then call the monsters for a dinner, and voila, no more Eva. What do you mean? You'll prepare both entertainment and treats for the students. They'll adore you for that, and you'll become the most popular again. I don't know. This is kind of too mean. <sighs> but you hate Eva. Uh, I do. And want to become popular. More than ever. Then decide. That's the best way. Nobody's gonna love zombies for nothing. Fine. Let's tempt the girls to go with us. Oh, oh wait a sec. We need an undercover because we look scary. Oh, we don't. Here is going to be a Halloween party. Everyone will be dressed up and no one will figure out that we're real monsters. Awesome. Then we'll talk to the girls there and convince them to come. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. What else? You need some more accessories. Zombie style. So, you think bandages is what I need? Well, you're rotting a little, so yeah. Is the party here? Oh! Dude, it's just a costume. I'm come in. Hello! <laughs> Quite realistic costumes, amazing! For real? Thanks! I'm just in character. Oh, uh, just take this and go inside. What's this for? You'll be handing out candies like the king and queen of the party. Sick. I knew her the best. You look great together. A guy who's afraid of supernatural stuff is meeting guests. That's smart. <laughs> <laughs> Trick or treat. Here you go. <laughs> uh, thanks. Uh, you know... You look like one cheerleader I used to uh -huh. know. There was some weird story, like she escaped from the coffin. I think Tina's friends were just too sad. They had hallucinations or something. No one can rise from the coffin. Yeah, weird indeed. <laughs> can I get some candies? Wow, you slayed that costume. It's them. I see. Uh, hey, do you want to see one creepy school? You can come with us. Um, what school? <laughs> There's the scariest party ever right now. Whoa! And the most terrifying costumes. Whoa! And very, very, uh, uh, wait a second. What's, What's wrong? wrong? Just my head, too tight. Gosh, what have you done? Oops, it was an accident. <sighs> we need to find them. Girls, <laughs> wait, wait. Monster! Don't scream, please. She said we had hallucinations when Tina rose from the coffin. We were just imagining it. Tina's dead. Rose, I just became a zombie. I don't know how to.
to explain it, but you're my friends, and I want you to visit my world. Um, no thanks. But uh, I feel lonely there. We could perform together. Let's become cheerleading stars among monsters. Tina, you weren't nice to us before, you know. Mm-hmm. Gosh, Tina, you can't do anything without me. Girls, in the world of monsters, there are no such beauties like you. You will become super duper popular. Mwah. You must come with us. Yeah! With great pleasure. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. <sighs> come on, girls. Well, great job. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> come in already. This is the room for the new students on campus. Make yourself at home. Or more precisely, get ready to be served. <laughs> Feels pretty unusual. What's this? Careful, or I'll bite your fingers off. Ah! <laughs> Time to scare and get scared. Oh, yeah? This is actually an awesome idea for Halloween. And this place has got such a mysterious vibe. Okay, relax. And then we'll rehearse the routines. Um, to be honest, I don't really know why we are even here and why we came. Are you sure we want to perform with Tina again? Well, Tina has always been a narcissist, but she's a good cheerleader. I suppose we can just benefit from this training. <sighs> want me to sing you a lullaby, girls? I can smell human flesh on our campus. We know you brought mortals to our school. People are not allowed to be here. Chris, I didn't expect that from you. Chill out. We'll explain it. You can try. These mortals are a gift to you. It was Tina's idea. They'll perform a cheer routine, and you'll eat her friends afterwards. Uh, why not eat them right now? Well, it's like an aesthetically pleasing dish serving. I'm new here, and I wanted to impress you. But don't tell the girls about it. The food will get scared and become tasteless. <laughs> right, be nice to them, please. And then you'll get the best show ever. Um, all right. You're pretty nice, you know, even though you're a zombie. Yes, we respect those who can surprise us. She deserves a chance. Hey! It seems like I can become popular. <sighs> and I can get some fresh human blood. <sighs> One, two, three. Four. Monster School Cheerleading Team, we can show the best routines. Awesome, flawless, we're on top. Here we go, we never stop. Woo! -hoo! The girls are kind of cute, and especially Tina. Ugh! Come on, Chris. They're just food, and Tina's a nasty zombie. What are you doing here? Does this thing cast magic? Hocus pocus. No. It's for the performance! Look! It's so graceful! Fairies love this! <gasps> and I can use it in synchronized swimming! Can we join you? Uh, of course! Come and repeat <laughs> after me! You can continue! I want some water! And... Yikes. Oh, it's okay. You know, in cheerleading, one of the girls is lifted and thrown during stunts. You can be our flyer. <laughs> Get her up, girls. <laughs> it seems they're having fun together. <laughs> Zombies are never hungry, but you need to eat something, girls. What's on the menu here? 
Try this beautiful blue eyes for a cutie like you. Ah! What's that? <sighs> oh, it's fake. Try it. Elves don't need real eyes. Oops. Are your ears not real either? They are. These are natural elf ears. So cute. Fair easy flower nectar. Try it, girls. Uh, thanks, but we don't eat stuff like that. The flowers are pretty, though. Oh, <laughs> it suits you. Who wants some fresh stuff? Uh, ew, the girls won't like that. Yeah, leave this werewolf food to yourself. Actually, I would love some of that. Let's fatten up the girls. Then they will taste better. Uh. Exactly. Come on, girls. Eat your fill. Thanks! Everyone is so nice. So sad that monsters are just pretending to be kind. I'll ask Tina out on a date. I don't care that she's a zombie. I like her. She will become popular when she'll feed her friends to the monsters. And I can then date her. <laughs> Hmm. Chris, what are you doing here? Come with me, Tina. I have a surprise for you. Okay, then. <laughs> Ta-da! This is for you. Ew, why is the table so dirty? Oh, I did it myself. For you. What? But why? Well, I set the table. Oh, and this is for you as well. But they're dried. Yeah, I thought you'd like such stuff. <laughs> But they're ugly. Ew, are those brains? That's disgusting. Well, just try it. It should be delicious. Well, I myself don't eat this, but you decided to make fun of me because I'm a dirty, stinky zombie. No. I thought you were nice to me, but you're uh, just like everyone else. Leave me alone. I better find the girls. But what did I do wrong? <sighs> I thought zombies love these things. But Tina's not an ordinary zombie. And she has way more class. <laughs> uh. Gosh, I'm such a fool. <laughs> hey, girls. Why did you call us? We wanted to have a girls' night. In the human world, we do this very often. It's fun. So, what are we gonna do? Have fun! Uh, we can show each other our talents. Thank you for your attention! Let's add some fairy dust here. We can do flying routines. Oh, awesome idea. I can do a water performance with pom-poms. <laughs> Together, we can become the coolest magic team in the world. Yeah, dream team. Now it's even sad that we'll eat them later. Don't worry, we can eat girls and join Tina's team. Right, I already want to be a cheerleader. <clears throat> hey, can you put me down? Leave it to the witch! Oh! <laughs> that was fun! <laughs> it feels so great with you girls! <laughs> Tina, we need to talk. I didn't want to hurt you. Then what was that surprise that you made me? I thought zombies like that kind of stuff. I just wanted to make a perfect date. So that was a date? Well, yes. But I ruined everything. Will you give me another chance? Oh, Chris, I like you too. It's my fault too. I kind of overreacted. I'm just not in the mood for dates right now. What bothers you? Uh, I feel sorry for the girls. We've become such good friends now. But you are friends already. Kinda. I didn't know how to be a good friend before. And now they are dear to me. I don't want monsters to eat them. But... You wanted to avenge Eva, remember? Yeah, but then I met you. And I'm not even that angry that she's dating Zack. I don't care about him anymore. <laughs> <sighs> well, we promised our classmates to give them the girls. 
That's the only way for you to gain popularity. And if we don't fulfill our promise, we're <clears throat> done for. I'm afraid you're right. It's still very sad. <laughs> Everything will be fine. It's a different phase now, and maybe you should let go of the past life and old friends. Maybe. I must put an end to it and forget my past forever. <laughs> this is for you. What a beautiful flower. Oh, it's in the pot. Elves love flowers very much, but we never pick them. Oh, I'll take care of it then. You are so sweet. You know, everyone here is kind of scary, but you're such a sweetheart. Well, yes, sometimes my classmates do some nasty things because they're monsters. And I just like to be obedient to them. But you can be good, right? You're not just a monster. Actually, I'm not. And an ordinary girl like you feels somehow closer to me than my classmates. Oh, will you come to visit me in the real world? We'll hide your ears with hair and no one will know you're an elf. Come see me later. Later. You know, there may not be any later. My classmates will murder the girls, and I won't do anything about it. Oh, I really got no time now. I have to get ready. We're performing tomorrow. Will you come to see us? Sure. Let's just spend this evening together. Hmm, I don't mind chilling with you. Hmm, and how can I betray her now? And three and four. Excellence is our name. We're the best, no other way. School of monsters, here we go. Rock your world and show your glow. <laughs> Thank you. Thank Ooh. you. Ooh. Ooh. You're, the, You're best. the best. Well, well done, done, girls. Did you like it, babe? Yes, that was fabulous. And now dinner time. What? Food! 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 Now we will eat you! What's going on? Tina, save us! Your friend's gone crazy! Silly girl, Tina is with us! It can't be true! Tina, please help! And you're asking for help? After stealing Zach from me? No, you'll get what you deserve, Eva! Oh, how do you know? I saw you two kissing! How could you call yourself my best friend? What the truth? You were an awful friend. And Eva started dating Zach because she thought you were dead. And Zach didn't have a girlfriend anymore. Actually, I always loved Zach. But I was afraid of you and didn't say anything to him while you were dating. And then one day he came to me and we realized that we want to be together. Uh, Eva, I've liked you for a long time. But you dated Tina, and she's my best friend. Our relationship was toxic, and now she's not with us anyways, so we need to move on. Mm, I don't know. It somehow feels wrong. Uh, you are so cool and kind, unlike Tina. We will be happy together. Zach, I really like you too. <sighs> Zach wanted to break up with you a long time ago because of how toxic you are. No, you're lying. Tina is sweet and kind. Well, I'm actually shocked because you changed for the better when you became a zombie. Yeah, I understand a lot. Don't listen mm. to them. They are just our prey. Uh, give them to us. You promise. No, I no. won't do this. Eva and Alice don't deserve it. Tina, I won't leave you. We'll save your friends. <sighs> Girls, run. We'll stop them. Back off. We'll fight for our friends. Ah, don't mess with us. Ah. Ah Beware of the witch! Here! 
hair! Ah, she grabbed my hair! <sighs> How about that? Your turn! Fairy dust. Not this time. Oh, my eyes are hurting. Ah! I have to catch you. Tyler, you said you like me, and the elves don't eat people. Well, yes. I really don't want to do this. It's all because of my friends. Why do you listen to them? You're strong enough to make your own decisions. You're right. I am so sorry. I really like you and I will not hurt you. Uh, you are free now. I will not tell anyone. Thank you. I will never forget you. I won't forget you. You showed me the truth. I do not want to be a gutless coward anymore. I will make my own decisions. Take that. <sighs> Zombie's breath! She'll put us asleep! <gasps> you did it! Great job! Uh, now we must go to the portal! Girls! <sighs> Hurry! It's in the locker! <sighs> Don't move! Where are the mortals? I want fresh blood! Uh, there they are! They ran away! Close it! Let me out! It's a locker! You tricked me, sneaky kids! Have a good day, Mr. Harry! Only after you, my lady! I'll get you! Ah. Welcome home! Uh, thanks! We need to find the girls and make sure they're okay! Uh huh! Oh, supernatural holidays are over. Thank God we're home. <sighs> Girls! <gasps> Tina! You're safe! Oh! <laughs> oh, no, no hugs for me. Tina, you've really changed a lot. And that's amazing. Forgive me for everything. Oh, uh, you know, I don't need Zach anymore. You can date him. I don't mind, really. Will you stay here? It's just that your zombie nature is too noticeable. And mine too. It's really not safe for us here. We must return to our world. Yeah, uh, but I doubt that our classmates will be happy about it. Baby, I'm with you. And I won't let anyone hurt you. We'll deal with everything. <sighs> now you have to say goodbye to your friends. Girls, I wish you the best and to become the best cheerleading team in our school. Uh, come visit us next time. We'll be so happy to see you. <laughs> Thank you so much, girls. Oh. <laughs> uh, fine. <laughs> <laughs> we have to go. <sighs> are you sure you want to return to the world of monsters? Chris, I want to be wherever you are. <sighs> You are the most beautiful and brave zombie I've ever met. I'm so lucky to have you. Let's go. You got nothing to fear when I'm with you. you stay with me forever. <sighs> Attack again and we'll show you the real power. We're not afraid of you. Tina! You're cool. You defeated all of us! You got the most powerful zombie magic! For monsters, whoever is strongest is the coolest. That's why you're the most popular girl in school. Oh my gosh! I finally made it! Yeah, you deserve it. Then you guys should join my cheerleading team! Yay! We love to! Go, 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 Tina's team! Tina is our captain! Oh! <laughs> 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 and one oh, and two. And, oh. Oh. Uh, Nate, 
I see cheerleading's not your thing. How about being the team's mascot? <gasps> what does that require? Just be soft and fluffy. Oh, and that's for me. School, School of Monsters is on top. top! Go ahead and never stop! stop. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> You're the best! Woo! Woo! I wanted to invite you to... To my world. To my world. Elves don't eat real eyes. Oh. You're supposed to stick it. <laughs> I didn't. You didn't see anything. I forgot the first two words. I'm afraid. Okay. I don't know about anything. Like, nothing. Yeah, he does. I'm just reading. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Don't laugh. <laughs> Why do you listen to them? You're strong enough to make your own decisions. You're right. I'm so sorry. I really like you and it won't hurt you. You are free now. I won't tell anyone. Thank you. I will never forget you. I won't forget you. You showed me the truth. <laughs> I do not I'm want so to be sorry. a gutless <laughs> coward anymore. Very sentimental. You know what? <laughs> no, I don't want to be a gutless slim and slimy. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot again. <laughs> Alex is crying already. Oh, Alex, don't cry, please. You promised for the first take. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. <laughs> I don't want to be a gutless snake. <laughs> Are you deaf? <laughs> Crazy girl! Uh, ah! Megan! Welcome to our school! <laughs> Hello, kitty. But why did you pop the ball? You were supposed to hide who you really are. And I will. I just couldn't help but teach these idiots a lesson. Okay, whatever. Let's go. I'll show you everything here. <laughs> Did I scare you? Uh, sorry, I'm Megan, the new girl. Uh, nice to meet you, I'm Tyler. Uh, wow, you have a firm handshake. Uh, well, I'll go. Wait! Uh, thanks. <laughs> Just a habit. I uh, always used to tie my little sister's shoelaces. You're strange, but I like it. Since you're new, I can show you around the school. Shall we go? Uh. Then we're going. Darn. Oh, time for class. <laughs> uh, sorry. I like her more and more. She's gonna pay for that ball. Don't mess with her, I'm telling you, she's dangerous. Oh, another upstart? I'll show her who's in charge here. Good morning. Good, Good morning. morning. I don't understand, newbie. Why aren't you greeting me? Because concept of good morning does not match my state. You decided to be clever? Maybe you'll answer the homework like this too! Asking a new student for homework on the first date is against school rules. You're going to tell me the rules? If you don't know them, I can tell you. Rule one, you can't yell at students. How dare you tell me what to do? I'm not yelling, I'm not even angry! You're angry. Your heart is beating at 110 beats per minute. Blood has rushed to your face, and you hit the table. <laughs> <laughs> Sit down already! Uh, <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> Good job. You show the teacher. <laughs> Woo you find this funny, huh? Hand in your homework. Tyler! Well, here you go. Take it. 
What is this? Why is everything crossed What's out? What's the difference if the answers are correct in the end? Yes, but the work should be neat. You get an F. But that's not fair. Sit. Next. <sighs> Shall we go out? Can I join you? Huh? Megan, are you with us? Uh, yes. I'm not going for a walk. I have things to do. Ah! What are you doing here? Did you come to apologize for your behavior? No. You should apologize for the unfair grade you gave Tyler. Are you out of your mind? I myself decide who gets what grades. Megan, what are you doing? No one is allowed to hurt Tyler. <laughs> ah! Tyler, oh no. Hello, Megan. Are you free already? I wanted to invite you to the movies. Megan can't today. She has extra classes until evening. Kitty? Well, okay. Can you tell Megan that I called? Yes, of course. Bye, Tyler. And what was that? Kitty, you're back. What the heck is this? We agreed that you wouldn't use me in your tricks. And you talked to Tyler in my voice? Please forgive me. I just... just... What just? If you don't like Tyler, just reject him. Don't involve me. I like him. Then why did you refuse to go out with him? We can't be together anyway. If he finds out about my past and who I am, it will hurt him. I can't be loved. Okay, I understand. Is everyone here? What are we watching? Let's play volleyball. Excuse me, Miss Lily, but Miss Christie was supposed to conduct the volleyball class. She's sick. I'm subbing. So why are we standing? Oh, uh, wait, wait for me. Zach. First of all, why are you late? And secondly, why did you take my face? Uh, you'll see. I read a book and learned something. Wait. Zach! Uh, wait, I'll fix it now. <clears throat> Glue together. <laughs> <laughs> it will be fine now. Uh, fix yourself, repair yourself. <laughs> Are you kidding? Wait, there's one more spell. <laughs> <laughs> Stop right there. <laughs> what an oh. idiot. Okay, let's keep playing volleyball. Let's go. Ah, oh, Harry, darn it, new sneakers. That's what you get for getting under my feet. <laughs> Hello, Harry. What do you want? It's a shame you dirty Tyler's sneakers. Now, you have to buy him new ones. <laughs> really? Leave me alone. You'll regret this, Harry. What is this chicken up to? How much longer, Anita? You know I'm working. You spend all your time at work. You've forgotten you have a family. That's how I make money for you. Great, but your son will soon forget that he has a father. Maybe that's enough. You are constantly arguing. I cannot even eat in peace. Who asked you? Sit and keep quiet. This isn't a family, it's a madhouse. See what you're doing? Well done, you yelled at your son. And what if something happens to him again? Nothing will happen. We brought that robot girl into town. Awesome, perfect. If there's a robot, you can forget about raising your son. Uh, Idiot. Psycho. <gasps> Megan, are you visiting me? Uh, me? Uh, well, yes. It's not the best atmosphere at my place. Maybe better at the school party? Let's do it. Kitty also invited me there. Ariel, why did you drag me here? We've been wandering around here for an hour. We need to find Harry. Where did you get the idea that he's here? I saw Megan following Harry, and they turned in here. That 
man! I lost them! Ariel, do you think that she did something to Harry? Yes! Does she scare you too? <gasps> You're crazy, bestie! Megan is strange, of course, but what could she do? Quiet! Did you hear that? Help me! <gasps> Harry! Help me! Harry! How did you get here? I don't remember. I injured my hand and can't get out of here. We'll help you! to dance together? Don't touch her. She just can't dance. Definitely dance is like a log. <laughs> um. I can dance. Okay. I take my words back. Well, that was cool. Bestie, you're the coolest. Are you enjoying yourselves? And here, our classmate Harry is in the hospital! What? What happened to him? Ask her! Ariel, stop it! I saw how she was following Harry, and then he ended up in a hole and doesn't remember how he got there! And you think I did it? Ariel, stop! The doctor said that Harry has temporary amnesia due to a blow to the head. It will pass. Harry will remember everything and tell us. Why? Wait! If it's clear that it was Megan! Calm down! Look at Megan! She couldn't beat Harry! Are you defending the snake? But… but I like you! Don't you believe me? What? I've never liked you, and I won't let you insult Megan! Ariel, let's go! Looks like Ariel bumped her head, not Harry. But even these quarrels won't spoil our party, right? Yeah! yeah! <laughs> hey! Maybe now we can dance together? Let's do it. <laughs> oh, Tyler, you have a hair here. Wow, she's definitely sick. <laughs> <laughs> that was a great party. Except Tyler almost kissed me. Too bad Ariel interrupted. Did you forget what I told you? I can't date Tyler. And a kiss would definitely ruin everything. All right, I'll be quiet. By the way about Ariel, is it true? You hurt Harry? What? Of course not. You trust her? Megan, I know that look. What look? Don't bother me. I have to do my homework. Speak up. If you didn't do anything, then show the record of how you spent the day. Are you serious? You don't trust your friend? All right, I'll watch it myself. <clears throat> oh, don't touch. You're scaring me. It's not my fault. Believe it or not. What the heck? Tyler, come on! Sorry, I didn't mean to. You stained my scarves! I didn't mean to. Let me wipe it. Learn to walk, idiot! Keep an eye on Megan. If she starts approaching Tyler again, write to me immediately. Got it? No. Nope. How about now? Oh, got it. If I see them together, I'll write immediately. <laughs> right. And where is Mia? What's going on? She's already 20 minutes late. Come on. Oh, she's written something. I don't understand anything. Megan, did you do something to Mia? It's time to stop her. <gasps> Be careful, Ariel. 
you could fall and break something. You're enjoying this, aren't you? Your fun won't last long. Miss Lily? Megan needs to be expelled from school right now. No, she should be jailed. She's dangerous to society. What are you talking about, Ariel? Mia has disappeared. <sighs> she didn't disappear. She urgently went to Europe with her parents. She'll be back in a few days. Really? Did she call you? No, she passed a note to me through Megan from her parents. No! Don't believe her! Megan did something to Mia. I have a video. Where is it? Oh, no. Megan deleted it. Why did she do that? Ariel, I think you're not feeling well. Let me take you to the doctor. You don't understand! Megan got rid of Mia, pushed Harry into a hole, <gasps> and she definitely got rid of Miss Christie! That's enough, Ariel! Stop making things up! Go and don't disturb my work! <sighs> Ooh. We should have gone to parties before! They're so cool! Yeah, only we were interrupted there. Uh, don't, Tyler! Why? I thought you liked me. Yes, but just don't. Uh, well, I will still win her over. If she liked the party so much, I'll throw one at my place. Oh, wow. I definitely need to tell Ariel about this. I will prove it. I will prove to everyone that Megan is guilty. What? Tyler tried to kiss Megan again? Ugh! I'll find out everything about her. There must be something on the internet. Not this. Not that. Also not that. Oh! What's this article? The latest development? A nanny robot? Almost indistinguishable from a regular person? So Megan is a robot? Nate, are you kidding me? Don't disturb me, I'm working. Someone's been knocking at the door for 20 minutes. Can you take a second and open it? <sighs> Where's Tyler? I urgently need him. He's not here. What happened? Megan! She's a robot! She might harm Tyler! How did you... I need to tell Tyler everything right now! No need. Tyler shouldn't know you. But what? We'll explain everything now. Poor boy. It's all because we didn't keep an eye on him. <laughs> Darling, don't blame yourself. We can't constantly walk with him and watch. <laughs> I accidentally heard your conversation, and I think I know how to help you. And who is this? How can a schoolgirl help us? This is not just a schoolgirl. This is Megan, the best nanny robot in the world. Her task is to protect a child. All of her views about her are five plus. <laughs> what do you think, dear? It sounds like a solution. Yes, we agree to hire this Megan. So you hired her to protect Tyler? Yes, and she's doing a great job. But he should not know who she really is. But he's in love with her. What if they start dating? And she'll take my Tyler away. Megan is a robot. They have no future. Tyler will finish school, and Megan will disappear from his life. So you don't need to worry. Yes! So I have a chance to become his girlfriend? Woohoo! That's everything. Tyler, Megan has come to see you. Finally. Let her in. Hi. Um, what's this? You said that we were having a party. Uh, yes, that's what I planned, but then everyone wrote that they couldn't come, so I decided to set a table for us. Look, Tyler, if this is a date, then I'm leaving. Please stay. Give me at least one chance. <sighs> All right. Great. Fine. Sit down. Try the smoothie. I made it myself. <sighs> Tyler, you're really getting on my nerves. Dad, you're not on time. 
You scratched my car again! I've told you not to ride your skateboard in the garage! I didn't ride it! Yeah? Then who? A poltergeist? Come with me right now! It's about time I broke this skateboard! Third scratch in a month! <sighs> Hello, Mr. Nate. Megan, why are you here? You're supposed to be watching Tyler. What are you doing in the living room? No one should hurt Tyler. Megan, what are you? Ah! Hi, Tyler. Why are you so sad? Megan ran away from the date. What? Well, who cares? Why'd you need this Megan when there's me? Leave me alone, Ariel. I've got tons of problems. Plus, my dad's gone missing. It's impossible to get through to him. Missing? I think I know what happened to him. Actually, Megan knows. What are you talking about? Stop blaming Megan for everything. But it's her. You don't understand. Enough. Megan. I don't want to listen to you. And leave me alone. But I'm telling the truth. Uh, Tyler, what are you doing here? Everyone's gathered in the hall for free hot dogs. I'm not hungry. What happened? Tell me. Maybe I can help. Okay, the girl I'm in love with ran away from our date without any explanation. I doubt you can help here. Yes, Megan is definitely in this town. We need to find her right away before she wipes this town off the face of the earth. <sighs> Megan, are you crying? No. You're definitely crying. I thought you couldn't. What happened? That's what love does. Even to a robot. Come on, tell me. I'm your friend. I can't control myself. I fell in love with Tyler and I can't reject him anymore. So don't. You two would make a great couple. But... I'm a robot. So what? Someone out there is marrying a car right now. What's the difference if you love each other? Do you think we should start dating? Of course. Let's go. I know where Tyler is. Megan, I... <laughs> what was that? Consider it my declaration of love. So you love me? Yes, and I'm tired of hiding it. Ah! That's it! I can't! I'm about to faint from the cuteness overload! So we're a couple now. Yep. Okay, lovebirds, let me take a photo of you for Insta. Everyone has to know about this. Smile! That's it! Woo! <sighs> Ariel, you're such a beauty. This Megan has no chance. Tyler will be yours. Whoa, Tyler posted a new photo? What? They're together? Wow, I was gone for a few days and you two are a couple? But what a couple. Aren't they great? Ah, I love you guys. Okay, okay. I think your friend is even happier than I am that we're together. Definitely. <laughs> Ariel will be so furious. <laughs> and there she is. You? You too? Ah! Ariel? Ariel, stop. Stop bothering Megan. I love her and we are a couple. You're an idiot. Do you even know who she is? A robot nanny hired by your parents. What? Nonsense. Nonsense? Look! Convinced? Is this true? And she's also destroying our town! Mm-hmm! Got rid of Mia, Harry, and Miss Christie! Ariel, hello! Harry and I are here! And so am I! But how are your... I thought you were... Thought what? I just had a cold and stayed home. I went to visit our aunt with our parents. I wanted to capture a beautiful sunset, didn't notice a pit, and fell into it. See, Ariel? Megan is innocent. What about Tyler's dad? He just flew off to a business trip in Africa without warning and there was no communication there. Uh, so I... 
I humiliated myself? Fine! Be friends with that piece of junk! Idiots! Whew. I can't believe she suspected me! Hey, what's wrong? So you don't love me, but my parents just sent you to look after me? Uh, no. Well, yes. I am a nanny, but I really do love you. I don't believe you anymore. Where is Megan? Be careful! Watch where you're going! Stop! Have you seen this girl by any chance? I haven't seen anyone! Get lost! <sighs> Are you sure you aren't hurting anyone, like before? Yes, I told you. I wouldn't do that anymore. I was just talking to them. So they wouldn't hurt Tyler. Why didn't you even tell me that his parents hired you as a nanny? They asked that no one knew. Now Tyler will never forgive me. <laughs> hey, come on. Stop crying. <laughs> Do you want ice cream? I'll go buy it. Let's cool down your circuits. Uh -huh. I'll be quick. Got you. Cindy? Listen, now you won't get away. Megan? Megan, where are you? Oh no, it seems like the developer is back. Why all the noise? Megan, she's gone! I don't want to hear anything about Megan. But the developer took her! She's going to erase Megan's memory! And where did she take Megan? The developer would need a lab for that. There's only one in our city and I know the address. Just a little more and you'll become a good robot. Stop this! Megan! No! She needs to be reprogrammed! You have no idea what she's done! She's killed a bunch of people! She's changed! Until her program is rewritten, she won't change! I won't let you erase Megan's memory and forget me! No! You're too late! <laughs> Megan! How are you? Megan, do you remember me? It's me, Tyler! Very nice to meet you. I'm the robot nanny, Megan. Oh no! It's another vlog! You asked, we do. What are we doing today? Well, we have Twister! You already know the rules because we already had a video with Twister! But it was too easy! We decided to make it harder! <laughs> Your My idea! I set everything up beautifully here! So, green. This is so? porridge. For yellow, in some places, there are poops. Elsewhere, there are whoopee cushions. Blue color, it's cat food. <laughs> or crackers. <laughs> and red. And red. Well, this yes, is slime. Uh, this is slime. Yes. Well, our hands will be dirty today. And legs, too. We have to take off our shoes. Mm. Yes. What? Why did you say that? Yes, yes, yes. You need to no, take off no. your shoes. No, no. We don't need to take off our yes. shoes. We don't need no, to. No, I didn't say that. Come on. All, let's take off our shoes. No. No. No, we will not take off our shoes in any case. Let's go. All. Sack first. Oh. oh, you've given yourself away. What's the joke? Your right hand goes on the yellow color. Okay. Yes, um, can we do a close up to hear the sound? Yes, listen. It's going to it's gonna burst now. <laughs> Thank you. Funny. <laughs> let's go. Next, Cindy. Your right foot goes on the red color. Oh, oh. Let's go, let's go. Oh! Let's go. Let's go. Slippery? It's really very slippery. Okay, Kitty, so, right foot on red, the same. Now, I think it's 100%. very slippery. It's really very You're slippery. Right so slippery. <laughs> I decided to trick you. It's oh, not noticeable. Oh, oh, oh. Let's move on. 
back, your right foot goes on the red color. Wow. <clears throat> that really suits you. Yeah. And so... <laughs> Next, Cindy. Your right hand goes on yellow. Let's go, let's go. Oh. <laughs> Gosh, that's funny. Totally. Kitty, your right hand goes on blue. Oh. Just not... Oh, sure. Next, left hand on yellow. Left hand on yellow. Ah! <laughs> Zach, your right hand should always be on top. Ah. Um, left leg should be in the air, Cindy. Left Help. leg in the air? Yes. I can't hold on any longer. Those are the rules. Kitty, left leg on blue. Woo! Oh, it crunched <laughs> me so much. Right foot on. Well, yes, right foot on. On green. Darn. <laughs> if I fall, I'll fall on porridge. Uh, I don't oh, want to. Oh, my hand. Oh, hurry up. So, Cindy, right, right hand on green. Oh, no. Right hand on green. Let's go. Ah! <laughs> Why are you landing on green? And Kitty, your right foot ah! is also on green. Yeah. yeah. Wow, wow, guys. Yeah, I won't yeah, be my able hand to is do numb. it now. <laughs> Ariel? Ah! Right foot on. Ah! Let's move on. Ariel, hand up. Ouch. <laughs> yes, slippery. Show how far you can stretch. It says here that your right foot should be in the air. Oh! Very slippery. Very slippery. On here. Ariel, left foot on blue. Oh, darn. Right foot on red. Ouch, Zach, what are you doing? What is happening? I have nowhere to put it. Why? Kitty, left hand on green. No. Yes. No, where's the free green here? Well, that's wow. it. Wow. Ah! <laughs> right foot on yellow, Ariel. Wow. <laughs> that's it. That's it. I've already got up. <laughs> Guys, stop, stop, stop. <laughs> I'm not playing this game anymore. Great. Write down. Do you like all this? <laughs> no. no we will then shoot more. Right foot on yellow, Zach. All right. I'll try. Cindy, left foot on blue. Oh, this is good. Carefully. Oh, it's right spinning. Right foot on red. Ariel, why is everything so easy? I'm untangling you. Right foot on yellow, Zach. Ah! Oh! Oh my god! Straight into the slime. Straight into the slime. <laughs> Where's my slime? Ow. I really love Christy. Thank now, you, dear Ariel, friend. Ariel, it's very yummy for us. So, left foot on red, Zach. Left foot on red, it's already there. Good. Whoa. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> we have a winner! Woo! Woo! <laughs> Hooray, oh. Congratulations, Cindy. Now we can eat all this. <laughs> all of me, all of me, please. <laughs> Here's your gift. It fell out. Thank you. <laughs> Guys, it was... Oh, my hair. Oh. How awful. It was unpleasant. Disgusting. I hope you liked it. <laughs> uh, hit that like button. Woo! Leave comments. Uh, who coped best of all? This prize here. And now, on the count of three. One, two, three. Bloopers! Hey. <laughs> You're going to mock me? No, wait, that's not it. <laughs> Hooray! Can't you stop, Anita? You know I'm, I'm working. I'm so glad I didn't take a bite. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> Just a second. I was nervous. So, you took her as a nanny for Tyler? Stop bothering Megan. I love her and we're a couple. 
Why didn't you even tell me that you're a nanny for? <laughs> Nonsense! <laughs> There's one in this city, and I know the address. <laughs> oh, wow, you have a firm handshake. <laughs> 